What's up, champs? Today I want to talk about DPS simulations, aka sims. Many times I have been asked if one item is better than another, and as much as there are cases with clear answer, usually it all depends on the rest of your gear and fight conditions, with answer about better item being different for all of us, especially if compared items are of the same level, just different stats. And this is where DPS sims come in. Good simulator will take all factors into account and calculates how much DPS will your setup do in a game. With that being said, sims are the most precise and reliable tool for different gear comparison. But now let's get to the actual use of sims. What you can see here is Osthewell's Mage Simulator. For all classes there are different simulators made by different people and all are used in the similar matter. But at the time of making this video, this one is considered to be the most accurate and acknowledged in Mage community. A huge shout out to Osphelos for that. You can find its link in the video description. Now, I will not go too much into detail, but there are two main sections that you care about. Gear and config. Let's start with the gear, as it's more straightforward. So, as you can see, there are tabs for all your gear slots. Now, what you want to do here is pretty simple. Just go to each of the tabs and select item your character is wearing at the moment. Also, don't forget to go down here and select your enchants and gems. When you are done with all the slots, you can go here to the overview just to check if you haven't missed anything. After that, we are halfway there. Let's go to the config section. Now, this might look a little complicated, but don't worry, not everything here is essential and it's actually pretty simple. Let's start here with details about your character. Select your specialization, your race and import link for your talents. After that, check debuffs, buffs and consumes you are using in your raids. Not every setup is the same, so maybe you do not have access to all the buffs, just select those you are usually getting. Sections for rotation and cooldowns are more for DPS tweaking and they are not so much important for checking the gear difference. Last important thing is fight duration because 1 minute encounter and 5 minute encounter are very different. Last thing to mention is number of sims. More iterations will give you more precise number of DPS but it will take longer. Just know that anything above 10,000 is just okay. And now we are all set. If I click run, it will calculate average DPS for the items and settings I have selected. But now for the item comparison part. Let's go back to the gear section and select for example back. I don't have best in slot yet, so I will click here on the little arrows and here next to the pen cloak and I will select Run Item Comparison. Now it will calculate DPS for all selected items. And as you can see, Penang Cloak is about 85 DPS upgrade for me. Like this, I can check all World War items and see what cloaks will be upgrade for me further. Let's just select all of these. And run item comparison again. I know that Sun Glimmer Croak is the best in slot in Udwar, but maybe chances are that it will not be your first drop. So you can check what cloaks are actually upgrade for you and maybe what cloaks are not. I can sort them by DPS. As you can see, Sun Glimmer Croak is at the top. And actually, all of those are upgrade, just this one is below my actual cloak. So you can see what is better, what is worse and how much they differ. And this is how you compare the gear options for you with your gear and your raid selection. And that's it. I hope you find this info helpful. Please smash the like button if that is the case. You can also subscribe me for more wits in the future. Now, remember that you all 
have been born to be a champion and i see you next time never break always fight never quit do it right play the game win your life have no shame there's no time feel the pain let the grind i could change in my mind pick a lane commit and climb the only way to win it life